do uh, to be able to get that information uh, from you, Jordan. Uh, but in general, it's those four steps. Now, in the book that I mentioned, which is Future Ace, which again is my first book, probably probably one of the uh, best things I ever wrote in my entire life. I literally outline it that way. So chapter one talks about gathering information. Chapter two talks about choosing a service. There's about 20, 25 pages on all the intricacies of the services, which you need to know. Um, and chapter three talks about uh, the um, uh, commissioning programs. Chapter four talks about the service-specific commissioning programs. And then chapter five, which is the last chapter, talks about executing your game plan. Um, there's a big frequently asked questions section at the end. There's also some information about some of the airplanes. Um, but literally walking through Future Ace, the book that I mentioned, um, is the first step uh, towards becoming, you know, uh, finding out the answers to the questions that you just asked me. Okay. Um, then the last question you asked, which is, what will make me stand out over the other candidates? And look, this is like, I'm not kidding you. This, this really is where the rubber meets the road. And the point on this is really simple. It's, it's just this. Um, you definitely, definitely do need to stand out. You really do need to stand out. Um, but what makes you stand out might not be what you think it is. It might not be your grades. It might be your leadership. Okay? It might be the way that you present yourself uh, to the recruiter. And so my recommendation is to be what I call the total package. Okay? So if you're lacking in one area, so stand out in another area like your physical fitness or something like that um, that you totally overtake every single else, everybody else that you want to, um, that you want to go against. Okay, um, let's see, yeah, here's a good one. OTS spots are extremely competitive in the Air Force, which is true. Uh, um, OTS, OCS spots are, are very, very competitive in every service. So in the Marine Corps, it's called OCC. In the Navy, it's called OCS. In the Air Force, it's called OTS. This is the pro 